Hello everyone, it's time for another Loot Crate unboxing uh, for January this month's theme as you can see is Invasion. We have X-Files, Space Invaders, Aliens, and Fifth Element. Um, so let's get this started. I had already kind of peeked into the box because I thought it was going to be my uh, order that I did for the mystery shirts. It's the mystery, you know, previous shirts they've had. I was hoping for, you know, the Loki Joker one and the... Uh, Legend of Zelda one they have so I thought this was the this was was what the box was but when I opened it up I saw it was the Space Invader so I decided to close it. I just saw briefly the shirt so uh, let's get this going. All right, let's see if I can get that for the first shirt here. Or uh, it's gonna be kind of hard to see. Uh, wherever it's faded out is basically green. But uh, right here is, is there's some uh, UFOs right here, um, alien right here. Wasn't really smart to use a green screen for this, but that's all I have. Uh, and on the bottom side of it, you have uh, the characters from the X Files, uh, Agent Sullivan, I think. I'm not a fan of the Ice Files, so I don't know the characters' names. Uh, is it Sullivan or Sully or something like that? I don't know. I'm not an X Files fan. I care less about the uh, new uh, series season reboot, whatever you want to call it. So you know, there's that. <coughs> All right, from Alien, we have the cute little alien. That uh, pops out of the chest or that latches onto your face, and you know, basically. Wow, that flash just stunk. Okay, so that's pretty cool. There's a nice little plushie there. Uh, let's see, there's a card inside here. The card's not really anything special besides saying from Loot Crate, so there's that. A nice little squishy thing. Been uh, dealing with a uh, cough and cold for this whole ever since uh, December started, so um, that's why I'm coughing every now and then. All right, the next we have is from Space Invaders. It's a mini alien vinyl figure. Kind of, it's not really that hard to see. Okay, let's open it up and see if I get a better look at it. It looks like there was multiple ones. You can get green, blue, pink, blue, or orange, white. It looks like I got orange, white. Let's see if I can get this fully opened up and out of the package. That's what it looks like. Like I said, I got the orange, white one. So if you got another one, then you know, good for you. Well, I'm fine with the orange, white. I would have been, uh, I would have been fine with all three of them, honestly. But I'll take the orange white. I think the blue green one is my favorite, but I like the orange white. If you're a fan of Space Invaders, I mean, you've probably played this game a lot. I just realized I put this in backwards, but oh well. I'll fix that later. All right. Now this is something they introduced. Um, as you know, they used to have the buttons, and they changed the button. Um, every, you know, every time it's a different design. Um, one thing I like is beginning this month is they're changing it for something called loot pins. Uh, as you can see, it's a, a giant robot with loot crate and there's a UFO in the background. Um, the one thing, cool thing about this is it's, it's supposed to unlock something. Um, so this is, um, if you go to lootcrate.com slash pins, um, this pin, I guess, lets you unlock something. I'm not sure how, but uh, maybe there's something on the back of the pin. I'm not sure. So, uh, but I love these. I mu I'd much rather have the pins than the buttons. I'm not really a fan of the buttons, but I do love pins. Uh, if you ever get the Funko pins of like Harley Quinn or which you've seen me unbox before, if you watch them my other videos, those are much better to have. They go good on lanyards. So it's definitely something much better to show off. I'm going to save the best for last because I see what the best is and I'm going to save it for last. We have a uh, LED flashlight from the X-Files. Um, Anti-shock switch. And there's crappy... Uh, wow, really? That even blends in? 
Oh, that's because of the screen. Um, <coughs> it's uh, some crappy no-name brand AAA batteries, so you will need AAA batteries for this. So I'm assuming you just need one or two batteries for it. You may need all three batteries for this, but if you did get this, you know, just if if you did get the flashlight, just go to Walmart and get some good batteries. All right, next we have. It's just a rubber band. Maybe it's something special. I don't know. Maybe it's attached to something. All right. I'm, like I said, I'm saving the best thing for last because I, I, I just love what it is. Okay. This is what um, some mini prints, invasion of the mini prints. So let's see what's the uh, prints are inside. We have the World Awards. World, the War of the Worlds. Ugh. Um, if you know anything about this, um, story, it was originally broadcast on radio, and people thought it was a real invasion, uh, invasion, and they were, uh, freaking out. Uh, it became a Tom Cruise movie, which I hate Tom Cruise, so, you know, there's that. Um, but this is really cool. Good thing to, uh, get a small frame and frame that up. <coughs> um, another good movie, um, I like the original better than the remake with Keanu Reeves, but, uh, it's the day of the earth stood still. Um, I definitely, if you've never seen this movie, definitely check it out. Um, either version, I mean, the Counter Reeves one was okay, but I like the original better. And I'm pretty sure that was all those two. Yeah, just those two. Um, if for some reason there was multiple ones than just these two, I would love to know what they were. Go ahead, put that. I love this box design. Before I get to the next thing, I love this box design. Which will be kind of hard to see on some of the things. As far as the green. I love this box design. It's very cool. One of the best designs yet. Alright, so we have the magazine here. I'm going to see if there's a... Uh, anything special with the uh, prints. Yeah, face hugger plush. Uh, I'm pretty sure I said face hugger. I, th I thought it came out of stomach, but it doesn't. It's the face hugger. <coughs> yeah, okay, yeah, it's just those two prints. I am not sure what the band is for. I mean, it's just a rubber band that was in there. That's weird. There's nothing special about the rubber band. Hmm. Alright, so I'm saving the best for last. Now, you know, like I said, there's fifth element, right? Right, well, fifth element, right? So, this is by far one of the coolest things I've ever seen. It's the little winter slip and the multi pass. And if you look, it has Lilu Dallas on it. This thing is just awesome. I, uh, I definitely say this is the best item to me. I'm a big, uh, big Fifth Element fan. Um, of all the series that's listed, I'm a big Fifth Element fan. So the fact they have this is just way too cool. Um, so if you're a fan of the fifth element and you're getting this crate, you're gonna love this. I wonder if it says Boston Paradise Special Flight Multi Pass. Oh, that includes plastic plastic card sleeve. Wow. Anyways, um, that's it for uh, this unboxing. Um, so I got my multi pass. And next month's theme, did they announce next month's theme yet? I don't think they announced, uh, it's kind of early. I've got this on the 19th here. So uh, they haven't announced February's yet, but I'm sure it's going to be just as good as this one. Uh, this is actually pretty much their best one lately. Uh, some of the other ones for me personally has been disappointing. So if it's as good as this for the rest of the year, I'm really excited for it. I can't wait to see what else these uh, loop pins uh, designs are. And I'm hoping this is a much better year for Loot Crate than last because it started off strong. And for me, as the months went on, while there were some good items in certain crates like um, the Vault Boy bobblehead from uh, November, um, overall it was just from you know June on it was just disappointing overall. So I'm really hoping this would be a much better year for Loot Crate. I'm sure it is. Um, <coughs> 
thank you for watching. I hope you liked this video. Uh, comment if so if you ever think of improvements. I hope you liked uh, what I do for the background every month. I try to keep the picture they use for it to show off what's going to be involved. Um, but uh, thank you for watching once again, and I hope you have a good uh, the rest of January, and I'll see you in February. Thank you for watching.